Hello gorgeous people welcome to my channel so today I have a collection of little stuff for you just again as I said for inspiration and let's get into it this video is intended for you to also go into your wardrobe look for spring pieces that you already have in your closet so I want to do this sort of thing that whenever I do a haul I must try to add something I have already in my wardrobe so that you can can imitate that if you like I think it's a good way to just revisit the items that you already have and utilize them because why are they sitting there? Why are you going to throw them out if you still like them and could still use them? So this video incorporates that line of thinking and I hope that you'll be inspired by it. So. First up is this piece here. You might have had a glimpse of it um, in one of my trying sessions. I can't wait to get you on the floor. Good looking. Uh, hey. This is a piece from this is the brand, but it's actually from ASOS. It's an overall striped and <laughs> I had the brown version of this I don't know where it is for some reason I probably threw it out or it's up there somewhere but I had it and really really loved it I took it to my country and this a moment of silence for it because this Centris, this centris, she ruined it. Oh my god! I asked her to just taper the leg in a bit because it has a wide leg, and because it wasn't sweeping to the floor, I wanted it tapered in. Oh, big mistake! Big mistake! Some people just some people just ruin your stuff. <laughs> yeah, I had like many moments of silence for that item. So I had to put it away so that I'm not constantly reminded of the mistake I made. So I purchased the black and I said never again. I'm going to hold it as dear to my heart. It's a little too big, but I love that because it means that I can wear it to work without it being too suggestive. Going out so hot, just like an oven. And I don't want to burn myself, but just had to touch it. But it's so fine. And it's so too sexy for the office. And we don't mind all the watching. Cause if they study close, real close, they might learn something. I'm so happy I got it again um, at least the black version of it it's the exact thing and the one I had was actually from a store here in Canada called garage so yeah I liked it but anyway yeah this is how I pair it you find some inspo love this piece my next piece is from this random store that I got it's a high-waisted track pants Ooh. 
Oh, you just got good jeans, so a nigga trying to cuff you. I be on my suit and tie shit, I think you can wear this multiple ways. You can wear it as a going out um, date night look. It has this gorgeous faux imitation sort of looking leatherish. It's not leather, but it. They did something to the fabric. They made it shiny, so it imitates leather. <laughs> Let me get a good look at it. Ooh, so thick. Now I know what it comes with the fatty. And I know she's so sick. Got a hit and picked up a habit. Uh, but that's alright. Cause you're all mine. It just gives you this nice, gorgeous leather imitation sort of panel on the side and it's just absolutely gorgeous i love the fabrication of it it's so thick and luxurious high waisted that's my name right there right there <laughs> anything with a high waist that's me and i just love it i think it would pair beautifully with my sam edelman booty or even my stuart wiseman booty not booty boots thigh high boots that's what i meant and it would be a great day night look but i think i would also use it for for a workout piece I, I like it as a workout piece as well, so maybe that's what I'll use it for, but we'll see. This is how I pair it. <laughs> light dress coat I don't mean like dressing up coat I mean like a shirt dress that you can use as a coat and I love it love the pastel color Catch papers, get high. Out Vegas, do say no doubles, ain't looking for trouble. You just got good jeans, so a nigga trying to cuff you. I'll be on my suit, 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 I'll be on my
and I want to keep it. So from my closet as part of my haul and an inspiration for you to go revisit your closet, grab one of the pieces that you haven't worn for quite a bit and you knew that you loved it when you bought it, this is my piece. What's yours? So let's do this guys. Don't waste your pieces. Put them back to use. Just upgrade them a bit. Add a funky belt or a classic belt, whatever belt you like, and just give them a new look and fall in love with them again. It can happen. It does. It has happened for me. It can happen for you. So yeah, this is how I pair this piece. For no reason, yeah. all saints for my angel, yeah. Alexander Wang, too. Yeah. Ass tight denim and some dunks. Yeah. I'll show you how to do And I know that, of course, stripes never stop being in. I got this skirt from Forever 21. I am not sure if I'm going to keep it, but it has the same flamenco vibe, it's a high and low. Has frills coming up in the middle here. And it's very long at the back. Doubles ain't looking for trouble. You just got good jeans, so a nigga trying to cuff you. It's a total mess. I'm not even sure if I'm going to try it on for you because it's so wrinkly that I'm embarrassed to even try it on. Do not try wrinkly stuff at home. It's not pretty. Sorry guys. Just don't have the time to iron as I said. But this is what it looks like. <laughs> Yeah, but it's it's a look. It's a look if paired correctly. And wisely, it would give you a look, but it tends to be a bit bulky because it's a lot of fabric. that's why I'm not sure I'll be keeping it but when I saw it on the model online I really really fell for it so that's why I bought it so we'll see if I keep it but yeah it's from forever 21 and I think it's at a price point of $33 which I think it's ridiculous it's not worth it but it's a hundred percent cotton so that's good and that's why I bought it I fell in love with the fabrication of it it's so it's such an unexpected surprise from forever 21 to have a hundred percent cotton that I am reveling in the fact that forever 21 is trying to upgrade so yeah it's what I've been asking it to do for quite some time so the piece I am currently wearing is of course this piece. I got it in a plaza from a vendor that sells linen stuff and it's absolutely gorgeous. I love the cobalt blue and the white button down details that you see there. And so I'm pairing it with my Zara belt and of course this bag it's just absolutely I fabulous paired this shirt dress with an unexpected pop of red because i love navy blue and red the same way i love red with check or plaid it takes your outfit to another level when there's a pop of color and some people are very scared of colors but i'm not I love a vibrant color, be it 
green, red, mustard. I love those colors. So I thought that this really goes well together. And of course, red is trending right now. Personally, I don't care what's trending, but I love this combination. So yeah, for your inspiration. <laughs> I can't wait till I get you on the floor, good looking. Uh, hey, going hot so hot, just like an oven. And I don't want to burn myself, but just had to touch it. But it's so fine, and it's so fine. Yeah, baby. And we don't mind all the watching. Hi, cause if this dirty goes real close, then my life. And this boots. I got this boot from Topshop. So it turns out this boot is too big. So, it's not going to be staying in my wardrobe at all. It's a no for me. See how huge it is? Look, guys. Along with a favorite pair of glasses. Oh, my God, I love that pair of glasses. It makes me look so, in my opinion, and I'm not bragging here, in my humble opinion, I think it definitely upgrades my look. I'm going to go get it quickly. I forgot it. guys this is a top shop brand and can this be any more gorgeous I love the colors I love the tiger looking print I love the big frame and now that all my glasses have gone <laughs> I have lost all my glasses they got ruined when I visited my country and so I had to replace them. So this is definitely one replacement that I absolutely love. I just love it. When I finish work on evenings and I'm coming home, I am dead tired. My eyes are red. It's, it's like I don't, I don't want to talk to anybody. And so I slap this on and I'm good to go. I am so good to go. I look refreshed and I look chic. I look fabulous, in my opinion. Love this to death. Another pair of, of sunglasses I got, as I said, I lost. I ruined the two I had. And if you think I'm lying, I'll show you. And this is the one I had for some time. I, oh, I hope I'm not flashing you guys. I don't mean to. But yes, yeah, this is a pair I had and I ruined it. I, I don't know how it broke. But yeah, I had this pair for a long time. I wore it everywhere. I still sometimes wear it like this to run to the corner store. I have been doing this and I'm like oh somebody was staring at me but I didn't care it's the new look as long as it stays on I'm fine with it somebody's gonna come up with this style to give you the one handle look as long as it stays on your face and it's protecting you I'm gonna still wear it I don't care <laughs> Because I didn't get my money's worth. It died too quickly. And I hated that. But I've got another replacement from Zara. This is a Zara piece. And this is what it looks like. I love it as well. It's also big. It has a similar shape to the Topshop one. So I think this is a shape that really suits me well. And I am just discovering it because in the past, I only wore 
sunglasses like this big and this shape and that's because I wanted it to cover my hyperpigmented areas and I didn't want the sun to keep on beating onto my cheekbones for some reason that's the only place that is hyperpigmented and I'm very upset about it I've been trying to fight it for quite some time now and these are the only glasses because they're huge and they protect my face so I often gravitated to this style but now I'm happy that I discovered these too so yeah hopefully they last as long otherwise I'll be very upset we'll keep you updated and next item from Zara I am looking for a flat pair of shoe that I could just put on when I'm leaving work because sometimes I like to walk home and the first time I ordered this pair of shoe I got it in 8 which is my normal size but for some reason it's it was made big and because of that it was too big for me so I ordered the 7 0.5 no 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 do you think Zara would get it right I don't know Zara is doing me wrong this time why Zara why they sent me the size 38 which is essentially size 7 so I am I was trying to try the shoe on and it's killing me I'm like why is this killing me oh my god get this off me why why that's when I discovered it's the wrong size but I love it and um, I'm gonna try to reorder again maybe it's not meant for me to be to be buying this at the full price anyway it's ridiculously priced but I love bows there is another one which has a similar which has a Gucci vibe with the chain detail but it's even more expensive so I am not about that life when it comes to shoes well this type of flat if it's a boot yes but I think frankly this should be like probably $39.95 so well I have to return it anyway I am not sure if I'll repurchase but I do love it I think it's a great style so yeah that's it guys that's my haul and I hope again as usual that you find some inspiration and I'll see you in the next one take care guys don't forget to subscribe if you're here and you have watched me for this long do subscribe I do similar stuff sometimes I throw in some high-end items that some of you guys don't look at but don't be dissuaded by it it's just stuff like belts and maybe an occasional bag which is not ridiculously priced but I am not um, the huge high-end person but I do love a taste of luxury and buying belts is my taste of luxury so I hope you don't mind when I throw these in what I normally do is I show you how I pair them just in case you also want to do the same that's simply my reason for showing them to you so love you guys thank you for supporting and thank you for subscribing and i'll see you soon bye